How's everyone going? Rufsack here once again, and uh, welcome YouTubers to um, a game I jumped onto today and thought it was worth posting, and I had a few thank yous and a few mentions and also a couple of links that I wanted to post in the description so you guys can uh, have a look at a few things. But uh, first of all, the gameplay here is, once again, I'm running around like a... Uh, an idiot with my knife. Uh, I get some C4 kills on a couple of vehicles. I'm pretty much only using the C4 for vehicles and I think I did cheat and throw a couple of grenades but only got the assist so uh, yeah we'll see, we'll see. I can't remember but this was a very intense game. Uh, I wouldn't say this is a, a close quarters map so uh, running around using the uh, the knife can be very, very challenging, and um, I've actually been enjoying doing this uh, quite a bit. I've been managing to get similar scores to what I get with uh, when I use an SMG or an AR, so uh, even though it's slightly more challenging, it's, uh, I know I really enjoy it. So I'm just using my radar here, waiting for this guy to come up on the left. Pretty sneaky way to start the game. He's looking for me, but doesn't matter. Rough gets the upper hand. Yeah, shoot the truck. Yeah, shoot the truck. Yeah, shoot the truck. Where are ya? No, that wasn't him. There was another one. There he is. Oh, no. In one door. Out the other. Thank you very much. So, yeah. Um, I want to take the this opportunity with this game to... Uh, to let you guys know that on my channel that uh, I entered into a... A, a, a home front top five. Uh, it's not a competition, but it's like a, a weekly thing that a, a guy by the name of uh, LT Doms, and there'll be a, a link in the description. Um, is doing like home, home front top fives. Um, something you see a lot of with a lot of other games, and really uh, something home front really hasn't had. And I think it would be something something that's needed, really. I mean, it's uh, a lot of us record our gameplay and just nice to uh, put little segments out there and I, I guess it inspires you too to you know try things different and come up with some gameplay that's uh, something that's unique something that can get you in that top five um, so yeah I, was, I submitted a, a couple of different videos uh, and I was lucky enough to get into that top five so like I said uh, LT Dom's website will be a website uh, YouTube account, I should say, though, will be in the description below. Um, so make sure you click on that and go and have a look. He has some other great videos as well. And uh, hopefully the top five uh, series will be something that uh, continues on and, and grows and grows and more people start to get involved in. I suppose it uh, largely depends on the, the life of this game. Uh, it's, since they've made some adjustments to it as far as uh, the maps and where everyone's playing and that, it's a lot busier and it's been a lot more fun and I've actually found less lag. Um, I don't know how everyone else is finding it. I'm in Australia and I'm usually playing with Americans but my connection is usually pretty good. Uh, I die a couple of times because of lag and I also get a few kills sometimes because the lag's a little bit my favourite from time to time but it's, uh, it's different. It's different from time to time but overall it's uh, it's a pretty good experience, so I've been pretty happy of late. But once Battlefield 3 and Modern Warfare 3 come out, we'll see uh, just how uh, busy this game stays. It's, it's a game that I'll always play and always come back to, so it's something that I still enjoy playing, and I've been playing it back to back. So, uh, I just love that. You know they're coming, you run away, wait, you count down your head a little bit, pop out, punch that button, get the stab, it's a pretty good feeling. Um, so yeah, so uh, also for a lot of you guys that are watching my channel, I'll also uh, sometime in the future, and I'm not sure when it is, but I, I would I would say probably within the next month or so, um, I'll be appearing on Wake Rider's channel. Uh, Wake Rider is doing a basically taken, given the opportunity, sorry, uh, his to his subscribers to post some videos and a commentary about themselves and, you know, how they got into gaming and all that sort of thing and uh, make a video 
and he's been good enough to on Sundays in America that is to um, to post it up and give people a little bit of uh, a little bit of coverage that might not get it. Um, I'm just happy to to be able to be involved in something like that and and like I like I say in the video, if I'm happy, if I can get some subscribers or something, that's fantastic. But at the end of the day, it's just nice to. Uh, to be sharing videos and getting out there with uh, some of the other commentators that are uh, online. So we've got a bloke coming up here. This is a bit sneaky, I know. But I tried to time it, so all I had to do was stab. Now, to see the lag there, was the lag was in my favour. And then I got stabbed. I deserve to get stabbed back. But you see the lag there? He was actually past me a little bit. Now, I don't know if that's because I'm using the... Um, one of the abilities I've got is... Uh, that's a knife. Now it says it increases reach distance, but I've found since I've enabled that ability that if they're a little bit to the right or a little bit to the left of me, where I used to miss them before, I seem to get them. So as if, as if there's like a, a, like a, a semicircle in front of me that's, that's widened and, and there's more of a strike zone within that. So some of the knifing kills you see uh, actually look like I miss them. That's a bit weird, but that's their system. That's how it works. And um, use it to your full ability. I mean, when you're knifing anyway, you're always at a, a pretty big disadvantage. So uh, do your best to um, to use what you've got. So yeah, like I said before earlier too, uh, I get a couple of C4 kills in here. Basically, on vehicles, I figure I'm running around with a knife. That's uh, there's nothing wrong with chucking a bit of C4. If someone's in a vehicle, they deserve to get C4. I can't stab them, so. My god given right, as far as I'm concerned. Do I get this guy? I can't remember. No, I get stuck on the cement. Da da <laughs> He stabs me. Oh crap. So um yeah, I'll be appearing on Wake Rider's channel and his his channel will also appear in the description. And also I've I've decided to also put in the description a link to uh, a few of the other guys that uh who have been com Put videos into the LT Dom's top five home front plays, and for some of the subscribers that will be appearing on uh, Wake Riders channel, I'm going to go through that through the ones that have already uh, posted up videos, and basically what I'll do is I'll put their links there too. So I would really encourage uh, all my subscribers, all 110 of you, even though only about 10 or 20 of you actually watch my videos. <laughs> I think, I wonder if that's like a percentage, I was actually thinking about that. Who's down? <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. Oh, feels good even when I watch it. Um, <laughs> I was wondering, like, there must be like a percentage, like, some people have like a zillion subscribers, but sometimes you watch some of their videos and the percentage of how many people actually watch to how many people actually subscribe. There's got to be a percentage. I don't know. I've worked out with mine. I reckon I've got sort of just over a hundred. And if I post a good video, then usually I'll get around 30 views or so. So I mean, it's it's a, like 35 percent or something like that. I don't know. My maths isn't that good. Oh, I missed him. Someone else got it. So, ah, ah, doesn't matter. At the end of the day, when I was playing this game, I was like, ah. Oh, what do I, I want to check my score? I want to check my score. No, no, no keep going, keep going, keep going. Because uh, actually, Wake Rider's got a really good video where it's—I uh, think it was like he said—it was one of his early on ones, one of the ones that I, I really enjoy watching. Um, where he did one of these running around with his knife, and uh, he did really well. So it's uh, something I want. I'm, I'm aiming to do is to get one really, really, really good one, and this is probably one of my best full games. That is. Oh, oh! Never give up, never give up, never give up. Sit down! Yes, got him! Here I am trying to fly through the air. So yeah, um, he got a really good video like that, and my goal now, and saying like that that's why I'm always knifing at the moment, is I wanna try and get five star threat with the knife. And knife only really. I mean I I don't really want C4 to be part of that because I think it would ruin it a little bit. I mean I think that's, even with C4, using C4 and the knife would still be pretty hard, but um, I've nearly I've nearly hit a 4 star and I really, really want to try and work on 
getting to a five. Um, I can I can pretty much get to a three star. I've, on most of the maps I've played, I've gotten a three or just over. So I think it's the problem is once I once I get up into that three star range, it starts to get a little bit a little bit cocky, and uh, I think you'd be you're invincible, and you got to stop to think that really you still only got your knife. So uh, you've got to use a lot of cover and. Um, you really got to use the environment uh, to your advantage. So the C4 kill here, I believe. Oh yes, and I get shot. Did I blow that up? Oh yeah, I did. I don't think anyone died, but maybe someone else blew it up. Ah, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Playing for the team. Yay team. So um. A lot of these guys I was playing with, uh, in some of the other games, I was trying to do this and a lot of it wasn't coming off for me. Um, everything started to meld pretty much in this game. Also, the, the finishing of one beer relaxed my nerves quite a bit and uh, seemed to do quite well there. But, um, yeah, so like I said, I'll, uh, I'll be appearing on Wake Riders channel uh, in the coming months and uh, I'm going to post a, a link so you guys can uh, check out his channel and when I finally uh, get that opportunity you guys can check that out and if you're interested in top fives uh, to do with Homefront you'll have LT Dom's uh, YouTube channel to go and check out plus uh, I think there's about three or four of the other guys uh, channels that I'm gonna post up that all deserve good viewing um, they always put out good videos a lot of their gameplay is much better than mine um, they're far more consistent players and like you can see with my sensitivity it's rather low but you know what I make do, I make do, I make do but in certain situations I get smashed because I can't turn quick enough or a few other things so uh, it doesn't matter oh that, that was nice those, I like those two kills there I was pretty pumped especially with the tank running around oh no what what oh 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 he so just fell over, he saw me just fell over he went He's gonna stab me anyway. I'll just fall over. <laughs> uh, I do apologise. I have had some beverages. Ooh, this is a tough little section here. The guy's coming down. He's shooting at me. I'm like, should I rush him? Oh, oh, get him! Up. Oh, there's another one. Oh, heal, heal, heal. I was expecting him to come straight down, but they both tried to flank me. That ended up being a mistake. Cause you're gone. Where's the other guy? Oh, there he is. Hug the wall, hug the wall. Hug the wall, jump. Dodge. Stab. For the win. <laughs> Someone else gets me. I was already half dead. But that was a nice little move. So, yeah, guys. Um, Just, again, thanks to all your subscribers. Thanks for the guys watching. Thanks to uh, my combat arms buddies that uh, watch my videos. I know you guys uh, get on and watch them quite regularly. Um, I apologize that this video goes for... 14 minutes, nearly 15 minutes, it's, on a, it's a bit long for some of you, but um, I wanted to show the full gameplay, I didn't want to show any snippets because for me it was a really intense game, really edge of the seat stuff, and there were helicopters, there were tanks, there were ABVs, and uh, I still managed to do really well. Okay, I came first. I'm not, I'm not going to say, okay, I came first, people. <laughs> I actually go 31 and 11, so, oh, Borderline 3. I know it's not quite a 3, but it's Borderline 3. It's pretty good. So, uh, we are the winning team. And, uh, I led the team to victory. Hurrah! Uh, thanks again for watching, guys. Uh, this is Roughsack signing out, and I'll catch you guys on the other side.